you, Ranking Member McHenry. I now recognize the Chair of the Subcommittee on National Security, International Development, and Monetary Policy, the gentleman from Connecticut, Mr. Himes, for one minute to give an opening statement. Thank you, Madam Chair, and welcome, uh, Chairman Powell. Congratulations on your confirmation. Um, I don't remember a moment as consequential as this one for the Federal Reserve or as potentially testing of its leadership. I think I have to go back to the end of 08 and the first quarter of 09 to think of a moment that was quite as important as Americans watched the economy collapse around their ears and, the, and, and their jobs and assets being lost. Um, there is a very real possibility that Americans will be caught in a vice, an economic vice, not of their own making, between inflation, which makes their everyday lives unaffordable, uh, and the possibility, much contemplated by economists, of a recession. Simply put, as one of the last members of Congress to get out of the chamber when it was under attack on January 6, 2021, I don't believe that our democracy can sustain either runaway inflation or another recession. And despite the rhetoric you'll hear all day today here, there's not a lot that we can or will do. Much of this rests on your shoulders. So Chairman Powell, I just ask that as you make your decisions, you think not just of the numbers and the economics, but of the importance of sustaining this nation's democracy. Thank you, Mr. Himes.